Not for work. Ooh. <laughs> yeah. Ooh. You wanna go to the boat? Yeah. Oh, okay. What's that? What's that? Ooh. That boat? I work for a small business, so I was a little worried at first that uh, people wouldn't be wouldn't be doing mm -hmm. things. Fortunately, my work kind of is necessary at this point. Um, so I've been working, doing pretty much just about everything as as normal. Still working my full hours. Still you know, getting workouts whenever I can. And we we did a lot of underground training and stuff um, during the summertime and working on a lot of footwork and head movement. That was the it, it affected me in, in some good ways, um, for the most part, because I, the bad ways that it's affected some people, it, it never really did. My job, I still had it, and my family's all good. Hey, what up, I don't even know what that is. <laughs> is that recording right now? I you drink Cuban coffee. How you don't know y'all drink Cuban coffee? <laughs> Paolo doesn't drink coffee. <laughs> I do. Small coffee like this. Okay. Coffeecito. All right, let me go see if Andre did the shit right. What time is it right now? I don't yeah, let's go see someone. Let's go see Andre. Hey, Andre. Andre, how much about Andre's on the sauna right now? You know I get down to door. 155. I got a question for you. What paperwork did your doctor fill out? Uh, with this doctor, did he do a full exam on you? Like a physical? Yeah. Uh, no. You need a physical. No worries. I mean, uh, <laughs> it could still get done. Physical, physical. <laughs> a whole six months to a year, depending on where you fight. Yeah. Oh my god. Okay. Don't worry, we got you. We'll we'll figure it out together. Okay, you want to fight, right? There you go. <laughs> Fill up papers. <laughs> Fighting with paperwork. Oh, our our house, house is open. The door is open. <laughs> hey, she loves. She sees TikTok. TikTok. She's like TikTok. Oh my God! Chicken wings. 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 very next thing so the very next thing for me I have nothing else in the books but high rollers and I want to do really good there I mean yeah I've got high rollers coming up uh, it's February 5th and 6th it'll be in Las Vegas uh, Nevada uh, it'll be fun it's basically just a, a grappling tournament I'm in the blue belt division and uh, we'll, we'll, we'll see what happens what happens in high rollers what do you well, you, I guess you smoke weed first and then go roll with your opponents and they hot box the heck out of that room, so. <laughs> What's the prize? Um, prize is a pound of weed, so uh, that'll be interesting getting it back on the flight, we'll see. Yeah. <laughs> it's as much skill as I have, I when you get in there, you're only using a certain portion of it, so. If I can pressure them and, and keep keep the pace on, I think that I can outlast just about anybody. Looking at the pools? Okay, you can see that the, the uh, new stadium from here, the whole thing. Thing's huge. Mikey, you have two days that we hope you're going to be jam-packed and busy. So today's the day if you want to do anything. Well, if tomorrow it's, it's basically all morning anyway, so we'll probably have the afternoon. Not if you keep winning. No, I... Who's calling? The next What's up, Josh? What's going on, boy? I just saw that you were flying out, so I was wondering who's teaching MMA. It's Daniel Swain. Did I talk? Oh. <laughs> the, they get the sun a lot longer than us. Wow. You got directions for where we're going to eat? Should we go to the Heart Attack Grill? Do whatever. I'm going where you're going. Wow. Hey guys, <laughs> what do you think about my hair? Be honest. <laughs> I watched your fight. Not impressed with your performance. Oh, who is he calling out? <laughs> Matt Hughes. I think. Yeah. How do I look, guys? For the best or for the worst? Be honest.
my name is Daniel Lopez. I am 38 years old from Southern California. I uh, transplanted up here into Spokane about eight years ago, and I started painting street art and murals. And I was working at a coffee shop, washing dishes. Every morning I would draw. I would draw for an hour. Every single morning I would make sure I was learning things. Um, and I had landed a couple jobs and miraculously it just snowballed from there. And over the past years, it's turned into a full-time business. And so this was probably around 2015, is 2021 now that I had done my first kind of real big serious mural and made a, made a buck off it. And I was like, dang, I could, I could do something, you know, if, you could, if I could make money with art. And so I pursued it. I chose this this scene specifically because I love, honestly, I love the skeleton suits and I feel that they were, um, you know, they brought a little bit of danger to the scene and plus the, the scene itself is pretty iconic. Almost anybody that's in their 30s at least has heard of the Karate Kid and so it's very familiar to You couldn't leave well enough alone. Could you little twerk? No, I had to push it. Now you're gonna pay. <laughs> this last one was was a lot better because I I can actually uh, think back to some moments of things that I I did right and wrong and. Um, just being in there and trying to outsmart him, like thinking, but while I'm in there, but I'm really not thinking. So it's it's kind of it's kind of a weird deal. It's you know just a just a small percentage of what I what we practice here in the gym and everything. I yeah, it comes through. COVID's affecting me, I've taken some of my gym time away, but as long as you stay self-motivated, anything's possible, you know? Either if you're at home, get a bag. Like, if you can buy random gains, just invest your money in something that's gonna get you better. For his opponent, 
Michael Sear! Look the mullet on this man. Look the skin. I can't tell if that's the leggings or the, the, the alabaster skin. And he's also from Elite Cannabis. Uh, no, sorry, Elevate Cannabis. Elevate. There's too much cannabis in the air, I'm starting to get confused. Okay. Your head had to do business. I think that's his game sure. plan unless what you get tired and feel money? it and then he go for oh, it. Oh, that's the same dude, right? Same yeah, yeah, that's his game plan for sure. These guys' names, because they've they been Mighty. representing. We, we, get, we got, we got yeah, Joe Dirt. Just keep calling him Mullet. Yeah, that's, you that's just called him one. Joe Dirt. That's Sweet, Joe thanks. Dirt. Now, I'm never going to forget that. Joe Dirt and fucking Michael Dirt. <laughs> right. Like, even if you even if you like have to like look vulnerable sometimes, you do it just to throw them off. No, I beat the first dude. I'm trying to think the move to beat the second Garcia dude. Garshawn Lynch probably. Was it? Reggie Bush. Reggie That's how Bush. it is in pool too. When you hit the ball, like you got to try to set up your next shot. Sure. Like you want the white ball to move. To where you, you can, yeah. It's, it looks like goddamn. Right. He's related to Boopy, huh? Yeah. Yeah. Oh! Yeah. Oh! Yeah. Back, yeah. Back, yeah. Back, yeah. Back, yeah. Backpack boy! Yeah. Joe Dirt. I Jesse bet that Zama. Joe Hurt. Zama. Remember his name? Zama for that pound. Okay, Remember the name? He's playing LB. He is not playing no games with nobody. I told y'all. You said what move that was? Yeah. That was a blue belt, so I believe he kind of straight angle. Yeah, that was it. He was it All I got is suits and gators. Y'all niggas lost, and I'm Las Vegas. Sorry, y'all ain't got no haters. Everybody love black ass dark Vader. You and your woman love to see me coming. Come through bumping, little kids running, chasing me down like the ice cream truck. These police, they never light me up. I'm that nigga, baby, hype me up. Fucking up bad work, they never write me up. They always hold me down and raise me up. And all these women wanna glaze me up. Never turned down, I'm turned up. You heard me, bitch, I said I'm turned up. Always on 10, always too loud. Always too hard for this bougie ass crowd. Even these haters, they love my style. So I don't know what you're talking about, huh? Sorry, y'all, I ain't got no haters. All I got is motherfucking players. We get money in motherfucking layers. Sorry, y'all, I ain't got no for the exchange, he, he just ready? really enjoys being in the fist fight. He loves it. He does not shy away from wild exchanges. Oh!